Okay. Thank you. Um, Your Excellencies, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, and more so, let me recognize Commissioner Josefa Sako and Madam Hadija, who have been to the podium as well. Friends of Africa and well wishers of Africa. Good evening. Before I make my remarks, uh, let me also point out that I'll be seeking uh, your permission or the permission of our Right Honorable Ray Lord Dinga after he has made his remarks because this is a positive environment for all of us and a competitive process that if there is any of our other candidates present uh, in this very honorable room, either for the position of chair uh, or the position of vice chair, we would be happy uh, after the presentation of the Honorable Raila Odinga for you to come and also greet this audience because this is a friendly competition amongst brothers and sisters and we'd be happy that we do it in a very peaceful and harmonious way. So let me go straight to the business of the evening. I am delighted to join this gathering of eminent representatives of all African governments to the African Union here in Addis Ababa, Ethiopia. I warmly welcome you to this event hosted by Kenya for its candidate, the Right Honorable Raila Molo Dinga, to unveil his vision and priorities for the African Union Commission chairperson position. Indeed, it often gives me pleasure to speak at the headquarters of our esteemed regional body, the African Union. At the moment, the African Union has advanced to play a frontline role in global governance and African solidarity. As you are aware, the government and the people of Kenya, led by His Excellency President William Samoy Ruto, have formally endorsed the Right Honorable Raila Odinga as the most suitable candidate for the African Union chairperson. In this regard, on 27th of August, 2024, His Excellency President Ruto hosted an event in Nairobi to officially launch Honorable Odinga's candidature. The event was graced by several African heads of state and government, and you are able to see it on the short film that was displayed to us. Your Excellencies, as the African Union gains global influence under the guidance of our heads of state and government, we presently need a candid audit of the AU's progress in order to spur our into an organization that continues to serve the African people